I got a story I want to tell you. Um, I am not musically inclined, never have been. And when I get through, you might say he still ain't. But about oh, eight or nine years ago, my brother, my younger brother had a heart attack. And they took him to the hospital in San Antonio. And my wife and I went up there to see him. And on the way home, she said, is there anything you want to do before you die? And I'm thinking, well, maybe she knows something I don't know. But anyway, I just kind of popped off and I said, yeah, I want to I wanna play the guitar and sing music. I was just joking, honestly. And Wednesday, this was on a Sunday, and on Wednesday, one of them brown trucks pulled up with a big, long, brown cardboard box, and I opened it up, and it was a guitar, and it said, get hot, big boy. And I promised her that I'd learn how to play it. I, I, I taught myself uh, YouTube videos and things of that nature, and I told her, I said, whenever you recognize something I'm playing, please let me know. <laughs> well, I banged on that guitar every night, and she put pillows on her head and rolled over, and, and finally one night I played a little song, and she really, this is probably 45 days after I got it, 45 days of practice, and finally one night, she raised up and she said, twinkle, twinkle, little star. And I did cartwheels all the way down the driveway. She finally recognized something. I'm gonna sing you a Jamie Johnson tune. I said, Grandpa, watch this picture here. It's all black and white. It ain't real clear as that you there. He said, yeah, I was a lover. Times were tough back in 35. That's me and Uncle Joe just trying to survive a cotton farm. The Great Depression. Yeah, sure, say that. 